simple and um, similar to, to most cars it's just different in that instead of having an engine we've got an electric motor instead of a fuel tank providing the energy we've got a battery um, so rather than visiting your local fuel station to top up you have a charge point system most people will charge at home but you can also charge on the go at motorway services or at uh, convenient places like uh, city centre car parks Great, um, but what if I'm going on a driving holiday or I need to get somewhere quick more than 155 miles away? Right, so it's, chances are if you're doing that sort of distance you're going quite far away from your home location. So you would probably be on A or, or even motorway routes and most major service stations now have rapid chargers there. The benefit of the rapid charger being that it can charge to 80% in 30 minutes. So it's actually quite convenient and fits in with a normal comfort brake. Okay. Great, uh, lovely car, surely it must be out of my price range then. Actually I think you'd be quite surprised, so it starts from just over 16,500, comparable to a similar size family car, um, that's including the government grant which is currently £4,500, so it's good that the government are trying to encourage adoption of electric vehicles and helping them become affordable. So what about running costs? It's actually a very, very cheap car to run, so a couple of things that you, you look at when you own a car is how much is servicing. Servicing is actually cheaper for an electric vehicle because you're not replacing engine oil for example and there's less to go wrong so you should find that over the lifetime of the vehicle bills are significantly reduced. As well as this the biggest saving comes as a part of your, your ongoing running costs by replacing fuel in a conventional car with electricity that this car uses. So home, home energy versus fuel is roughly 80% cheaper so it, it, it actually can be a significant benefit and over time the more miles you do the bigger you're saving. We actually calculated that the, the leaf can run cost from just 2p a mile to run. Any other interesting points? Yeah one of the really good features is the Nissan Connect EV app. It's a smartphone application where you can actually send remote instructions to the vehicle. Uh, one useful feature being that Imagine it's um, the middle of winter, really cold outside, we know we're going to go out and get into an ice cold car. What you can actually do is load up the app, tell the car to preheat itself, and then when you go out to the car it will be really